Thanks for messing around in Vampire Survivors Beswick 237. We got some Vampire Survivors Castlevania collab going on today. Ode to Castlevania. And we are unlocking Alucard himself. Liam. No, it's Adrian. Liam, someone else. He's got Charge, Soul Steel, Level Up, Dark Inferno, Overheal, Plus 8, Summon Spirit, HP Critical, Sword Brothers, and Immune to Health Drain. That seems absolutely insane. Oh boy. Hey, it's no longer new. Well, that was quick. Tragic Prince himself. Uh, can't Gemini. Beginning, of course. Oh, slashing. Interesting. Alright, let's see what Arcanus work with. Does he start with Alucard Swarb? Hmm, <laughs> hmm, hmm. Up everything at once. Nah. You want to go to the whip or the sonic whip? I checked it out, and there's like, oh, what's that in the corner there? Well, beginning. No, what am I thinking about? Moonlight Bolero. I remember this time. Oh my god, he's so fast. Ha! <laughs> His animation. Uh, let's whip it up. Here on the map, sure can. Well, that's not a good start. Sonic Whip, good. Where's more often while moving? Uh, let's just banish for a bit. Okay, so I missed six passives on my roll with Sonia. So I'm gonna grab those. Yeah, this is the Elkart Sword with base damage up. Okay, so it looks like he gathers charge while standing still. Uh, Pomerol is one of the ones I'm missing, so I have to grab that. Go figure. Oh, Bolero's not picking up. Discus is on map. Got 60 movement speed. That's insane. And I can just use the Armadillo to pick up some other ones. So it's Pomerola. Skull, wings. I think it's going to be wings. Sonic Whip, wings. You know, that makes sense. Da 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 da. Is of anti synergy with this charge mechanic. One more projectile. Da 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 da. Spellbinder. No, oh, I should remember this. A bracer. It can't be bracer. It won't be bracer. I could have grabbed empty tome there. Look at Swarb. Base damage up by five again. A lot of damage up. Ooh. One more projectile. There's some blue stuff coming out. He has a lot of health, too. 266. Jeez. I mean, it's... Spellbinder, maybe. Just barely, maybe. Right, but what else? It was a... Uh, skull Wings. It's all steel. I wonder if there's a way to increase that charge. I had Candle Arbor I don't need that. Uh, that's Tetra Spear, isn't it? Da -da 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 -da. Or Spirit Blast. I already forgot the name. I had Tronus Box, don't need that. And the Dark Inferno goes. I mean, I'm, I'm certain it won't be Bracer to evolve the whip, but I need to be sure. Oh, what was the other one? Base damage up. Not a lot of whips showing up. That's not a good sign. And I got the armadillo, so I can just whip it that way. Blast them with spirits. Okay, so they die out pretty easily. I had stone mask. 
Ooh, I wonder if uh, duration increases this spirit thing. <laughs> 225. Oh, that's so much. Uh, maybe Cerebonde. Could be a pickup that would be not bad. Dark Inferno! Blast it. Use that from the gate. You just need to know what the button inputs are. Seems. I'm certain it's wings. I don't want to risk skull, but I'm gonna have to. Who knows what the sorb needs? Yay, wings! I should save soul steel till. Yeah, go fight the plant boss. Beat it up. And then. Ow. Da, 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 da. Mm -hmm. Ah, it's a classic. Yep, figures. Wow, it even stuns you. This definitely increases, uh, not just with stain still, but something else. More projectile and only five damage. Doesn't do that much damage, but it's nice. Double level. Damage is actually quite poor. Damage up by 10. Oh, it does evolve. Uh, while they're cut swords, that person is the swords true bear seek out enemies. Oh, like the super. <laughs> yeah, it's the actual input ability for the Alucard sword. You go intangible and do a dash attack like this. It means I'm going to want duplicator for sure. Ooh. And awakening. Or awake. Ooh. Okay, it's not just the projectiles, it's how many fire or how many slashes they do. Okay, that's interesting. That's fascinating. Heads. Full steel. That'll knock a type of spirit out. Bracer is useless. I swear there was something else, too. I got armor at the end, but that should have maxed out. I should go back down to fight the bat. That'll get me some... Hey, skulls. I don't think the brace is going to do much, but I have to be sure. I don't even think it can affect the whip just due to the way... Oh, wow. It's huge, and yet it's still smaller than you'd expect at times. Oh, alright. I need to beat something up with Alucard, don't I? Should have checked that. Wait, it keeps it leveling up. Ah... Yeah, it means I should have waited for that triple chest to unfold. Oops. Uh, fires one more projectile. So many Alucard swords. Base area up 25%. Got very big, very fast. I can't remember what the last one was. I had Candle Arbador, right? Right? Alucard's everywhere. Oh, the Castlevania Symphony of the Night sprite work was so amazing. Da -da 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 -da. Weapon time, yay! Oh, right. I need other. Should have gone sword in time, eh? Okay, what would I need to do? Game jump again. It seems like it didn't need a weapon to evolve. Uh, sword plus sorb. Wait, is it? Oh, it's like a bracer, right? It... Oh, that's fascinating. If that's Alucard shield, then you've just win that's like one of the most broken things in gaming 
Oh yeah, I do contact damage in a platformer and I'm invincible while doing it. I win and it does a ton of damage to me. I wonder what these blue numbers are. I have a spellbinder or it's axe that boosts it. Spell's the only other one I can remember. Wait, why am I not? One more projectile. One more, then I can try to evolve it to the shield, right? Full arrow. Arrow adds power. Power beyond measure. <laughs> oh. They see you up again. Alright, let's see if it turns into the shield. No. Hmm. We'll turn to the shield now. Nope, with the alchemy. Okay, let me open up the grimoire. Plus plus. Yeah, it's the bracer path. Bracer equal two, then equal try. I'm not sure why it's not moving up. All right, let's get that arcana in the way. <laughs> Project Princess. We roll. It's pearls. Ah, uh, nothing actually affects the sword. I guess want slash for whipping action. I'm gonna be getting whips of plenty. And I came all this way to fight the giant bath, and I never actually fought the giant bath. I got distracted on the Medusa. That raw spirit. Get alucarded. Dominus Anger, what? Where is the penny projectile? Drains health? Okay. Isn't Dominus Shinoa stuff? Why did I unlock that? I didn't unlock her. I do love up wings, I do believe. Or let's get wings to max. Man, I've seen two Toronas boxes and no skulls. I don't want to banish any accessories because I have Bolero. Your use is on the map. I'm a Sanger. Duration increased. Oh, wait, that's the thing behind. That's firing off behind him, isn't it? Interesting. Whip of Alchemy go up. Hmm. Must be something else to get the shield. Damage up by 20. Like, man, where is this skull at? And nothing from the Boleros either. No eyeballs. Maybe I should just fill out my inventory. I have plenty of stuff I should have grabbed by now. Oh boy. And then I could have just armadilloed the skull. I'm right next to it after all. Yeah, I'll just armadillo the skull now. Oh, I still haven't done Karoma's mana. Okay, but all of all of these Yes, only the skull and the Karoma's I don't have. So let's see if that does it. Yep, it does. It's. Wait, why? Did... No, it wasn't evolving with wings, so it has to be skull. Christogram tip. I should have read that description first. So it just fires out like normal. 
And it doesn't seem to really do anything differently. Well, I don't need to level up Skull for whatever it does. Don't get that till I get a level so I can fill out my inventory. Crown, perhaps? Wait, what was that? That fired off. Oh, maybe it's one of those uh, every so many attacks go off. It does a super move. That's what a lot of them have been doing. Man, without that crown, I'm really feeling the slower. I don't even have higher growth, too. Crazy. Crazy high growth. Well, what do you expect from Alucard? What was that? So many crazy effects he's just pulling off. Well, I don't know what Dominus would be. Well, the ones I have could work for it. More projectiles. They like enhance. It's like a garlic that only works if you're standing still. That's definitely only activating when I'm standing still. This is odd. This is so weird. I might as well pop a soul steal. I think it's just a full clear. Not close enough to it. Stone mask, I... Wait. I need stone mask for... The... Book? But I have that. I need to look up. But vampire. Uh, well, no. Let's get things that haven't actually evolved something yet. Because that's more likely to be a case that's necessary. Or like spinach or coronas. Will do. Or the Karna thing. Do you be even faster? Oh no, that's just the effect of wings. Then I can start grabbing all these delicious chests. Yeah, uh, definitely something popping off with how many times the Sonic Whip fires. To do the Chrysogam attack. Well, it's not even like a real Chrysogam. It's like a Grim Fandango version of it. A real Chrysogam would kill everything on the bloody screen. <laughs> oh, intense speed, you're crazy. Thanks. Well, this will accomplish nothing, but figure it out. Hey, I'm spending a lot of time down here when I could be doing other stuff. Hey, Tails. It's like the first one. Candle Labrador has not evolved anything, so let's start picking stuff up. Hell heart right off the bat. Probably really wasn't hoping. Crown would have been nice. But heart is helpful. No weapon action, huh? Huh. Did movement changed something about it? The Dominus only has six slots. Interesting. Oh wait, I can go grab the whip. Mm -hmm. Or the Tear Jisu. Not that's all that helpful, but hey. Yeah. Man, I'm taking a lot of damage. Whip up one. Hmm. It'll take quite a lot to get Fualhawalu. 
Here I still don't have bloody pentosacro. Well, whatever I get is whatever I'm gonna get. Slash other cards. Slash. Still don't know what pops up. Oh, maybe it takes the top, the Aegis to get it. Whip first so I can get bloody tear. Bloody tearing up the night. No, an empty tome. Not empty tome. Alchemy whips pretty close. In fact, I have so much stuff right now that I can just empty the chest and move on with my life or my own life. Uh, what a dragon whip. Andy box. That way I can get the Vento Sacro. Okay, they're all here. Ooh, I need to evolve the tomes to unlock them correctly. Vampire with a whip. What a shock. Okay, there we go with you. I don't know if you're on the map or not. Crap. No, I don't see you. So I should have grabbed you. Wait, no, you don't evolve. Well, you'd probably evolve the Dominus thing, right? Oh, let's put that ludicrous speed to good use. Oh, wait, I wasn't getting hit. That's not my health bar down there. I get all the passives, then I don't need to worry about anything. Good. Well, I need to get the chest with... Uh, Wait, where'd the eyeball? Oh, wow, it's still alive. Hey, spinach, nice. Yeah, let's get whooped Falk me up so then I can get Vampire Killer. Good and plenty. They stack. They stack. If you stack multiple heart refreshes, then you get killer, killer healing regeneration. Fuck me whip. Vampire killer. And it does not require the maxed out tier Jisu. Alright, let's get Slorgan and Gaiban dealt with. Hey guys, how's it hanging? Boy, is this not any for you. Huh, it changed to teal. Was it black? It was red and black. Hmm, maybe I need to be a certain level in order to get the sword, or maybe I do need the... Hmm. Well, we'll see. Ah, oh, it's a lot of damage. That soul steel exists. Bye, dudes. Wow, you don't like getting slashed by Alucard, huh? Three chests to grab. Come on, give me a fiver. Ooh, Super Candy Box 2. And with that, I can grab... Idomancer tip. Yeah, yeah. That's some crazy luck he's been having. Spinach. Home. Bit of Sacro. There's my level up storm. Oh, well, whoops. Well, I suppose it doesn't much matter. Hydro Storm! Charge is still closer this way, I think. I should go fight himself. Hello, card, fight yourself again. 110 movement is so nice. Clear that out of the group chat. Yeah, the color changed again. 
Maybe I need to just level it up a lot. Okay, let's zoom out. Okay, let's go fight you, then I can teleport around. Get some other stuff done. Get destroyed, you. Low heart. That's nice. Let's be healthy. Age is both huge and tiny in its own way. So weird. Time will stop during the fight against the doppelganger. That's good. Now, your 2D Alucard. Doesn't that feel familiar? Okay, the Dominus works, so... So, my dudes still attack like mad. Good damage. Not exceptionally huge, but man, they'll just... really get crazy. Uh, yeah, it's sweet, sweet Symphony of the Night boss track. Rockin'. Only got garlic. Wait, I leveled up. I do not turn. Can I just fire off random dark infernos? Do. Woohoo! That car loves to flip. Hey, yo. Just the Vento Sacro level. And go up. Mm, I care about Silver Ring. Not particularly. Hey, another chest. Neat. Now, we're no longer 2D. The camera actually can't keep up. I think I was moving so fast I broke the camera. That's not good. Well, maybe a teleport will fix it. Oh, there it goes. I mean, it's not too much to ask, right? And just go down. Wait. There's here. Well, that's confusing. Imagine trying to explore this place without the map. That'd be horrifying. Let's go down first. The Atlantean and the eyeball will teleport with me. Gotta watch that map. I can grab the shuriken one here. And beat up the boss. And would it be efficient to get the boss now or later? Mirror of Truth. Oh, and Stone Mask. Can I Labrador? Well, I got 12 more to go through, so. Hey, do I just go right in the wall here? Angelic sniping dude things. I'm all the way over here, so I should fight you, whatever you are. Is this an actual weapon, or is this a pickup over here? I'm still not there. This is just a pickup. Okay, that's what that was. Oh man, so much damage. Hey, Sword Brothers. Kill everything. Yes, yeah, Sword Brothers must. Wow. Storm of Gibbons. Alright, oh, I didn't even fight the boss here. I didn't even see what this boss was. And there's my level up Storm. Has to be the parm if anything. If any passive does it. Okay, you. Uh, 
some bug guy. Not particularly impressive either way. You have increased curse. No. Just normal curse. Eyeball down. Go up. Boss down, Atlantean down. Not even Atlantis can be stopped by thing. A little soul steal there too. Okay, I gotta go make sure that this is what I thought it think it is, and that's the throne room. Yep, this is absolutely the throne room from Rondo of Blood and Symphony of the Night. There's even the teleport of the inverse castle. It doesn't seem like I can go to any inverse castle right now. There's definitely the option. Oh, hey, the secret. Secret room, can I get up there? Let me get up there. I hit the button, but it doesn't seem like the stairs have descended correctly. Okay, well, let's go back to fighting normalish stuff. Those are very durable up there. Get crazy. Silver ring, still not evolving the sword into the shield. Maybe there's something else I have to do. Alright, grab this chest, go fight some of the oh, bosses. Okay, isn't one of them right down here? Be faster. Yeah, it's gonna be faster to hit him this way than go. Do the goat one? This is King Gate. I still don't have access to that room on the left, it seems. Maybe I have to defeat all the bosses in one run and that'll unlock something else. Running out of time, though. Yeah, this is some Edward Scissorhands kind of dude. And I have a eyeball, too. Ah, yes. Keep making my enemies more durable. Gold, the only thing left. That silver shuriken is nothing. Gale Force! Sure can. Okay, so... Then it's the one over there. How am I getting silver ring? I get Gale Force since I need to know if it can evolve with anything I have. These are mostly things that I didn't have last time. It should. But then again, I might not have had the chess. Oh, I don't even have to run into you. Eventually, I'll have enough damage that it's fine to take that. And that time is now. This is right at the start. So get up here, get the dim thing real quick. See if well, I can't evolve it because I don't have the stone mass. Eyeball. Lame well, doesn't count as boss, but the eyeballs and the goblins do. Probably save that chest. Or at least one of these. Six. You're very fast. Here, um. That doesn't matter, though. I blew way past this dude. Oh, not even on it. Soul Steel! Got cards everywhere. Oh, the Atlantean's on me. The jerk. Oh, maybe the armor was the one that did it. Our yellow card wears armor. Seven for Gale Force. Wings, wings would make sense for Gale Force. Don't grab it yet. Look fine. Chest, no. 
must get something else first. There we go. Good, big level up storm there. That'll give me the shuriken at the very least. And hopefully the Gale Force book. Yeah, got it. The new my Tempus, Ball of Gale Force also triggers a spinning tornado. With Bracer, not wings, really. Oh, I got the shield. Gift of Alucard Sword absorbs and triggers all other equipped evolutions. Orange shield. What? 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 Oh my god. Maybe you have to get six evolutions to trigger that? Jesus Christ. It seems like they're still activating too. It just clears up inventory space. It's insane. Also insane that this is still around. I hear Sword Brothers firing off too. Okay, let's let's go back down. Da, da, da. No, it's way down. And it's still less down than you think. Oh boy. This may legitimately be the most overpowered weapon in creation then. It still gives you the effect of all your other ones. That means you get paranormal scan with it. I mean, it seems like it's still firing off stuff normally. I don't have armor. I do have knives, though. Blow everything down, I guess. Uh... Get the knife here in the ring. Yeah, it feels like... It sounds like Sword Brothers is activating, but it's not. Still don't have an evolved curve knife, but one of these has to do it. Wings, maybe. How's it hanging, tree? All right, I got the guy down there, and then some other stuff up top. You drop that ice book that I want, so I'll hit you up first. You're very close. Yeah, I'll kill this guy, then switch there to the ice book, and then the weird spider head guy, the spider chama. Yeah, let's go with that. Yeah, this guy is no trouble. Doesn't pop anything, right? And Karasu's here. Yay, Karasu. Wait, I can't evolve anything yet. Or possibly ever. Can't see where the circle is. Yes, yeah, the puppet guy. Hmm. One of those is the plague guy. The other one drops the is the crab battle. That's what it is. Curve knife up first. Go grab discus. I don't know. Trying to get the bosses down. I'll just focus on that. Over. Over hasn't evolved anything yet. Let's go, Alucard. Kills aren't actually going up all that high. 
My raw point kill power isn't so great. Okay, yeah, this will be much faster to grab these two. Don't forget to grab the book this time, me. Where are you at, crab battle? Curve knife. May my knife curve forever. Oh, hey, stone mask so I can get the terra topper. Talk to soul eater. Another soul eater. You can't actually have damaged me that much. Wait. I have the book maxed. Does it really require max foam? Or max stone mask? That's awkward. Oh, there's another one. The boss is here. Oh man, I might not have enough time. Still the faster route though. Getting stuck doesn't help. But if anyone's gonna make it, it's gonna be 110. Speed Alucard. Grab that chest. Stone mask level. Much lower level than Sony because I didn't get crown. Crack orb. Where you at, boss dude? You are. Oh, you're that really derpy looking chase thing. You do not stand a chance. Well, nothing does, but. Sword. Oh, the swords are all now different colors. Oh, wait, you actually did damage. Oh, it's because it's an Atlantean, because. Why is there an Atlantean? Didn't I kill all the Atlanteans? Uh oh. Almost down to two minutes. Let's outspeed that mirror till the boss is up, then get more mount from it. Get the boss. There might be a hidden passage to there that I didn't notice. That uh, area with the cough, second coffin. I presume the second coffin anyway. Because, you know, it says there's a second coffin in the stage, on the character stage. And the one in there is... There's gotta be a secret passage somewhere I missed. Oh, I have not put any levels in Ice Fang, huh? Nothing on the curved knife, either. There we go. Ooh, this is gonna be a maze, isn't it? Okay, not really. Get up, grab that armadillo, and go. Browning. Oh no, let's get whatever this does. Nice thing. Coffin's gotta be around here somewhere. There it is. This is Julius, right? Thank you, Alucard, but the vampire's in another coffin. Okay. Yeah, Julius Belmont, the man who defeated Dracula. I think this is the last boss, so maybe if I get ready, you something happens. Wow, you're very big. Uh, are you still there? You dead? I can't tell. Oh yes, Metaglio, right. Is that Galmoth's shadow or something? Go, vampire killer. Is it dead? I can't even tell. It keeps getting blacked out by everything. Oh, 
Files an edge. Think it's dead. Really, nothing else. It requires max clover. Oh, let's revive. I can get that vacuum. Sure, I'm not lasting long against death, huh? Whoever could have seen that coming. Uh, I just want to try to find something. Oh, there's a vacuum. One more revive. Nope. Find Julius. Evolve the Alucard Sorb to get Christopher unlocked. And get Dominus Anger to level 6 to unlock Dominus Anger. I guess it's just unique for Alucard to get that. Uh, the Chris Graham tip. Why are they... Oh, is it maybe because they're no longer equipped? Okay, but, well, the Chris Gam tip did the most damage by far, 24 million, 19. Nothing else was in the 20s. Alcart Swords did a lot. Alcart Shield did nothing, because weird. I guess it stops counting them if they combine with the shield, maybe? That's so much stuff, though. That's Alucard done. And we've unlocked the next one in the row, which is going to be Christopher Belmont. Reed can occasionally affect might and armor, can find special pickups. Another day down, another not Belmont done. Alucard has managed to successfully do it and also really make it annoying to actually put his number down, but 1,959 done on the best. Quick word of that. Brad, that. Characters, that many down, and 177 to go. It just keeps getting bigger, and there's so many more to go, and so many more after. Thanks for messing around in some Vampire Survivors Beswick. I hope you had some fun. Please like, dislike, comment, or subscribe if you haven't, and thank you anyone who has. Either way, have a good day, and keep Odin to Castlevania.